Hi everyone, this is Venkat Krishna from Chris Software Solutions. In this video, we are going to discuss about introduction of Selenium and what are all the drawbacks of manual testing and why we need to go for automation testing. So I am planning to do all the uh, videos for beginners who can uh, who don't know about Selenium, then they can follow my videos. Easily you can understand and you can able to uh, get a job by using Selenium. Nowadays, more openings are there for Selenium. I if you know Selenium tool, then easily you can get a job anywhere you go. You can search it in nowcree.com how many openings are there for Selenium. So based on that easily you can understand. Okay. So we are going to see in the beginner videos by using Java and then I will do the uh, some more videos for Python also. So please follow this beginner series. Easily you can understand and you can able to uh, get a job or survive on Selenium. Thank you. Let me enter into the video. What is automation testing? So and also I have done few more videos on manual testing. If you don't know manual testing, please try to go through those videos so that you will understand what is manual testing and why we need to uh, go for automation testing and uh, these details you will get it from the manual testing videos and any doubts will be there please in the chart you can mention it any doubts and any questions i will try to do more videos on that thank you and coming to the automation testing automation testing is something like we are doing testing with the help of a third party tool we are using some other tool to automate our application what is automation coming to the manual testing everything we are doing testing by seeing with our eyes we are manually entering the data we are manually clicking on it we are manually selecting the drop down item and we are entering the test data manually these are all operations manually we need to do as a human being coming to the automation all these things will take care by the tool whatever the operations you are performing manually all those operations tool will take care to perform on your application tool will click on it it will enter the data it will select the item in drop down it will select the checkbox it will uh, select the radio button it will click on the link so all these operations tool will perform on behalf of us that is nothing but automation testing manual testing is something like manually you need to perform each and everything automation testing is whatever you want to perform you are giving instructions to the tool then tool will take care to perform all those operations on your application and tool will give you what is passed what is failed as a tester finally we need what are all passed what are all failed those results we need to give it to our management so those all operations tool will take care to perform on behalf of us and tool will give us the results what is passed what is failed that is nothing but automation testing so manual testing some drawbacks are there so see here more resources are required for manual testing and more time is required no accuracy means no correctness no repeatability no reusability also no reusability is something like manual testing one sprint you have done in other sprint can you automate i mean can you automatically do that one in manual testing no in the next sprint also you need to do manually in the third sprint also you need to do manually if n number of sprints are there you need to test each and everything manually in manual testing whereas coming to the automation one time you develop the system or tool understandable statements those statements you can reuse n number of times okay n number of sprints you can reuse those statements and tool will give you results like what are all passed what are all failed that is the importance of automation testing and also if you are doing manual testing keep on obviously the testing team will get tired and boredness it is a boring job same thing again and again testing it is a boring job to the manual tester so that is the reason nowadays more openings are there for automation testing genuinely i am telling even in the interviews and all nobody is looking for the manual people but one more thing without manual testing no automation testing also 
how that is i will tell you in the coming videos but manual testing will be there automation is a continuation to the manual testing so because of all these drawbacks we need to go for automation testing okay so when we need to go for automation testing for any project application should be stable enough like at least 70 percent and more than that then only we can go for the automation testing why like that why 70 percent stable if for example let we take one application we need to test on that application or we need to automate most of the functionalities are not working then how we can automate we need to flow end to end right so in that case manual team should be available they have to do first time testing on end to end if everything is working then we will convert those steps all those steps into a instructions which is understandable to the tool so that is the reason manual testing always will be there but in the interviews and all along with manual testing they are looking for the automation testing experience or knowledge also because of that who know both manual and automation they can do uh, manual testing and they can do automation testing also that is the current days market standards the interviewers or companies are looking for well and coming to the why we need to go for automation so it is a fastness will be there less number of resources accuracy will be there accuracy means correctness reusability will be there repeatability will be there how come repeatability and reusability because one time you develop the instructions which is understandable to the tool n number of times you can reuse the same instructions whenever you want to do testing just execute those instructions it will give you pass or fail so without human intervention we can able to uh, we can able to test the application without any human intervention just you can run it even run also you no need to do in automation there are a number of tools are there to do our job just you need to set your time at that time automatically your scripts will start and it will run it will give you the results to your mail mail itself only automatically it will send you a mail that is the importance of automation so companies are not liking to do everything manually they are looking for the people who know manual testing and also automation testing that is the reason more number of openings are there for testing and also some of the people are asking me how the openings nowadays we no need to worry testing always will be there testing jobs always will be there n number of jobs are there on testing but as i told you you need to know automation testing also how many days development will be there those many days testing also will be there we no need to worry about our jobs but we need to improve our skills as per the current market standard if i know manual testing and i want to do lifelong manual no it won't work you need to upgrade your skills to automation testing okay so that's all for this video thank you if you like these videos please subscribe and share and encourage us okay if at all you are having any questions and all please put it into a chat box and let me know so that i will try to do more videos on that thank you